So the next is Bresenham's circle algorithm. Now, in case of Bresenham circle algorithm, it considers the eight-way symmetry of the circle. So, if we are plotting the points in the one-eighth part of the circle, then the rest of the uh, points in the circle, other seven coordinates can be uh, plotted. So, as we can see in the uh, figure, Uh, 
we assume that P, P is having the coordinates x i and y i and we have to uh, find out whether T is nearest to the true circle or S is nearest to the true circle. So let the distance from a region origin to pixel P is that is having the coordinates as xi plus 1 and yi is equal to d of t. It is equivalent to xi plus 1 whole square plus yi whole square minus r square. So this is our equation number 1. And similarly uh, we say let the distance from origin to pixel s. So the coordinates of pixel s are xi plus 1 and yi minus 1. So let it be d of s that is equal to xi plus 1 whole square plus yi minus 1 whole square minus r square. So this is our equation number 2. Now let di be the decision variable. So how to find out the decision variable? di is equal to d of t plus d of s. So this is our equation number 3. Now we have to put the value of d, t, d of t and d of s from equation number 1 and 2. So therefore di will be xi plus 1 whole square plus yi square minus r square plus xi plus 1 whole square plus yi minus 1 whole square minus r square. So, what we will get from this equation? We will get 2 of 2 multiplied by x y plus 1 whole square plus y i square plus y i minus 1 whole square and minus 2 r square. That is our equation number 4. So, there are two cases arises. First case is when di is less than 0, in that case d of t will be less than distance of t will be less than distance of s. So we have to plot pixel t. And the second case says that when di is greater than or equal to 0, that is d of t, magnitude of d of t is greater than or equal to magnitude of d of s. In that case, pixel s is the nearest one and that we have to plot. So, that we can try. Uh, now, we have to find out the value of the decision uh, parameter at i plus 1 at step. So, the value of d plus this is variable at i plus 1 at step from equation 4 will be that is the equation number 4. So it will be di plus 1 is equal to 2 of xi plus 1 whole square plus yi plus 1 whole square plus yi plus 1 minus 1 square minus 2r square that is equation number 5. Now we have to subtract equation 4 from equation 5. So we will get di plus 1 minus di is equal to 2 of xi plus 1 square sorry whole square plus yi plus 1 whole square plus yi plus 1 minus 1 whole square minus 2 r square minus 
टू एक्स आई प्लस वन होल स्क्वायर माइनस वाई आई स्क्वायर माइनस वाई आई माइनस वन होल स्क्वायर प्लस टू आर स्क्वायर सो आफ्टर सॉल्विंग दिस इक्वेशन फॉर एस वी कैन सी हियर सिंस एक्स आई प्लस वन इज इक्वल टू एक्स आई प्लस वन सो द वैल्यू ऑफ एक्स एंड आई एस टेप इज इंक्रीमेंटेड बाय वन वेदर वी आर सिलेक्टिंग टी और वी आर सिलेक्टिंग एस so the value of x i has been incremented by 1 unit so we can replace x i plus 1 that the uh, x uh, value of x at i plus 1 step is equal to value of x at i s step plus 1 so we will get di plus 1 minus di Is equal to two of x i plus two whole square. So because x i uh, value of x uh, at i plus one has been replaced by x i plus one, so we will get x i plus two plus y i plus one whole square plus y i plus one minus one whole square minus two x i. Plus one whole square minus y i square minus y i minus one whole square. So after solving this equation, we will get d i plus one is equal to d i plus four x i plus two into y square i plus one. Minus y i square minus two into y i plus one minus y i plus six. So this is our equation number six. Now we will again again consider case one. Case one is if T is the chosen pixel. That is, D I is less than zero. In that case, T will be selected. So, in that case, if T is selected, then the value of y coordinate at i plus 1 term step will be y so therefore d the equation number 6 will become d i plus 1 is equal to d i plus 4 x i plus 6 so we will get the value of this is in parameter at i plus 1 term as this one so we will call it as equation number 7 now case 2 case 2 is if s is chosen so the pixel chosen is x that is when we will choose a s when di is greater than equal to 0 that means the distance of s is less than t or we can say d of i is greater than equal to 0 so the pixel s will be selected In that case, when pixel x s is selected, in that case, the value of i uh, y uh, in case of i plus one step will be y i minus one because the value of uh, y has been in decreased by one unit. So, y i plus one is equal to y i minus one. So, uh, the value of d i plus one. Is equal to d i plus four x i plus two y i minus one square minus y i square minus two into y i minus one and my minus y i plus six. So after solving this equation, we will get d i plus one is equal to d i plus four into x i minus y i 
plus n. So this is our equation number eight. So if this pixel has been chosen, then we have to calculate the value of decision parameter at i plus one at step step with the help of equation number seven. If di is greater than equal to zero, in that case we have to uh, calculate the decision uh, parameter's value at i plus one at step with the help of equation number eight. So we can combine this two equation into one. So we can write. Therefore, the decision parameter's value at i plus one at step is either di plus four at i plus six if di is less than zero and di plus four into x i minus y i plus ten if di is greater than equal to zero. So these two equations we have got from equation number seven and eight. So finally, we have to find out the uh, value of in, uh, decision parameter at point zero. That means the first point, initial point. So finally, we set the coordinate as zero r because we have to start from this position where. x axis is 0 and x coordinate is 0 and y coordinate is r that is the radius of the circle so this is the initial point the starting pixel coordinate and base di is value from equation 4 that we have done so it is d of i is equal to 2 0 plus 1 square plus r square r minus 1 square minus 2 r square so after solving this equation we will get d i is equal to 3 minus 2 r so that is the initial value of this in parameter that we have to calculate this is equation number 9 So uh, these are the equations seven, eight, nine that we have to use in the algorithm to find out the value of decision parameter on which, uh, uh, on the basis of which we will select either pixel D or pixel S that is to be plotted. Symmetry. This is figure that is showing the 
एक वे सिमेट्री ऑफ दी सर्कल सो वी हैव टू प्लॉट नाउ व्हेन वी आर यूजिंग प्रेशर एंड सर्वजन वी आर सेइंग दैट वी आर वी आर फाइंडिंग द पॉइंट्स कोऑर्डिनेट्स ऑफ द पॉइंट्स फ्रॉम 90 डिग्री टू 45 डिग्री एंड रेस्ट ऑफ द पॉइंट्स विल बी प्लॉटेड अकॉर्डिंग टू दिस पॉइंट सो नाउ द एल्गोरिथम स्टेप 1 इज वी हैव टू सेट द सेंटर ऑफ द सर्कल that is the x c y c coordinates of center set x is equal to 0 y is equal to r because we have to start from this pixel right and the decision parameter's value will be 3 minus 2 r now in step 2 we will test to determine whether the entire circle has been scanned or not so for that we have to write a condition the condition is if x is greater than y then we have to stop uh, as you can see here we have started with x is equal to 0 and y is equal to r so x is less than r so when x is, x becomes greater than y then we have to stop that means we have scanned and noted all the points in this particular quadrant so the next step is we have to plot the eight points found by symmetry with respect to xc that is the center xc and yc that is the center and the region or it can be somewhere else and current x y coordinates so we have to plot plot x plus x c y plus y c so that is the first point we have plotted this point here then we have to plot next point that is minus x plus x uh, plus x c y plus y c that is this point then we will plot this 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 and all the points in the other objects so we have to plot y plus x c minus x plus y c plot minus y plus x c minus x plus y c next point is minus x plus x c minus y plus y c next point is minus x plus x c minus y sorry it is x plus x c Minus y plus y c. Then the next point. Minus y plus x c. X plus y c. And the last point is y plus x c. X plus y c. So we have to plot as we have got only two point. A uh, one uh, point that is from 90 degree to 45 degree. So we have got x is equal to zero and y is equal to r initially, and then we have plotted the uh, all the eight points. Now, step number four. We have to compute. 
compute the location that is to be plotted next. Now, initially we have got d is equal to 3 minus 2r. So, we have calculated the initial decision parameter. Now, we are checking if d is less than 0, then we have to calculate di plus 1 that is equal to d is equal to d plus 4x plus 6 and we have to calculate, uh, we have to increment the value of x by 1. Because in this case di, d is less than 0, so we have to plot pixel t that we, uh, we have already done in the last figure. If d is greater than or equal to 0, then we have to calculate di plus 1 that is equal to uh, d is equal to b plus 4 x minus y plus 10 and we have to increment the value of x by 1 and decrement the value of y by 1. So that is step number 4. Then step number 5 is go to step 2. So in step 2 we are checking if uh, x is greater than y then we have to stop. So this is the uh, Bresenheim's algorithm to scan the word uh, circle. Now we will solve a problem by using this algorithm. So that is the table that we have to make 
So we have come from this position. So D, uh, 0 is less than 8. So we have to plot this initial point that is 0, 8. So it will be 0, 8, 8, 0, minus, sorry, 0, minus 8, minus 8, 0. Then 0, minus 8, minus 8, 0. And then we have You can see here, 0, 8, 0, 8, because it is positive, so 8, 0, then 0, minus 8, minus 8, 0, then 0, minus 8, minus 8, 0, so we have plotted 3, 6, 7, 8 points. So, it is, we have plotted first one, then second one, then third one, then fourth one, then fifth one, then sixth one is this one, a seventh and eight. So we have plotted all the points. Now we have to check. Initially, di is minus thirteen. Now, when di is less than zero, so the condition is in step number four. It is written that when di is less than zero, then we have to calculate d is equal to d plus four x plus six, and we have to increment x by 1. So it is better if we write here d uh, is less than 0 then d plus 4x plus 6 and x is equal to x plus 1 and if d is greater than equal to 0 then we have to calculate d by using d plus 4 x minus y plus 10 and we have to increment x by 1 and y, we have to decrement y by 1. So according to these conditions, now d is less than 0. So we will use this value of d to calculate the value of this parameter at i plus 1 x step and we have to increment x by 1. So it will be minus 7 and value of x initially value of x is 0 so it will be 1 and this will be 8. Now we have to plot these points 1, 8. 8, 1, minus 1, 8, 8, minus 1, 1, minus 8, minus 8, 1, minus 1, minus 8, and minus 8, minus 1. So we have plotted all the 8 points. Now, the value at this position will be minus 7, so that is less than 0. So we will calculate the next value of di plus 1 by using this equation only. So it will come out 3. So that means we have to increment only uh, x, that is 2, and y will remain as it is. Then we have to calculate, we have to plot 2a. So we will plot a 2, then minus 2, 8. 8 minus 2, 2 minus 8, minus 8, 2, minus 2, minus 8, minus 8, minus 2. Now, value of d, d is d in this case. So, now in this case, d is greater than or equal to 0. So, we have to calculate the value of d at i plus 1 step by using this equation and we have to increment x and we have to decrement y. So after calculating the value of di plus 1 we will get minus 11 here. This will be incremented by 1 and this will be decremented by 1. Now next is next point that we have to plot is Now, we have to plot 3, 7, 7, 3, minus 3, 7, 7, minus 3, 3, minus 7, minus 7, 3, 
minus 3, minus 7, minus 7, minus 3. So these are the points that we have to plot. And now the value of dy will be minus 11, that is less than 0. So we have to increment x by 1, that is 4, and y will remain as it is. And it will come out 7. Now again we have to plot 4, 4 7. So it will be 4, 7, 7, 4. Minus 4, 7, 7, minus 4, 4, minus 7, minus 7, 4, minus 4, minus 7, and minus 7, minus 4. Now, the value of D is 7, so that is greater than 0, so we have to calculate by using the this, this condition, so it will be we have to increment x by 1 that is 5 and we have to decrement y by 1 that is 6. So we will get this 5. So we have to plot the point 5, 6. So it will be 5, 6, 6, 5, 5, minus 6, minus 6, 5. Minus 5, 6, 6, minus 5, minus 5, minus 6, and minus 6, minus 5. Now, the value of D is 5. So, that is greater than 0. So, we have to increment uh, x by 1, that is 6, and we have to decrement it by 1, that is 5. So, the value of D i plus 1 will, will be 11.